Well, probably some of you are quite familiar with the ingredients to video feature in Google Flow. So basically, with this feature, you can easily create a video, but the video might contain some ingredients or pictures or items that you provided. Now, in this case, I can upload up to three pictures into the video. But unfortunately, I actually have plenty of pictures that I want to include in the video. So I have these images that unfortunately uh, exceed the number of ingredients that I can include into the video. But there is actually a simple solution for that. In fact, we can just use the AI feature from Gemini to fix this issue. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to navigate to gemini.google.com and basically I want to create a photo collage or photo grid based on all the photos that I have prepared for my VO3 video. Now here I'll just drag and drop all the photos into Gemini and you can do the same and after that you can insert a prompt that look like this so the prompt goes like this faithfully combine these items into a photo collage with six panels now here you might want to specify the number of panels based on a number of items or photos that you just provided to gemini and after that click tools and click create images and send the message by the way uh, this method is quite simple in fact you can also do this without using Gemini AI. You can use Photoshop, Canva, or maybe some other image editing tool to combine multiple pictures into one image. Now, there is another thing that you need to know that is right now we don't have any decent control on Gemini to select, select the aspect ratio. So usually the last image that you provided to Gemini will be the final aspect ratio of the picture. Anyway, I got a, this nice picture. As you can see, everything is now combined into one image. I'm going to download this. And after that, after we have downloaded the picture, you can go back to Google Flow and I'll just start creating a new scene. So let me just uh, delete this. And now, instead of uh, using all the three slots, I can just use one slot. So uh, that one picture contains all the images that you might want to appear in the video. So that's very useful. It's very efficient. And you can even add many more items into the video. So that's the power of using uh, this technique, which is basically using the grid or photo collage that was created via Gemini. Now, I'll just uh, create another video and this is going to be using this prompt. So in the prompt, I just specified every item that appears on this ingredient and uh, make sure to select VO 3.1. At least that's the model that is able to use the ingredients feature. Maybe in the future, there's going to be a better model or more models in the platform. But right now, this is the model that I have on my account. Now I'm going to just send the message and just wait for AI to generate the video in about two minutes. Okay, so this is the result. And as you can see, I can verify that there are all the elements that I provided in the ingredients. There is the red sneaker, uh, cup of coffee, hat, and then corgi, car, and also a fan. So everything is now in the video. Now let me just play the video so you can see the result. Okay, so that was unexpected because now we have two dogs and two cups of coffee, but you know, that's a separate issue. But basically, this video was created uh, with multiple ingredients, and yet I'm only using one slot from the three ingredients available in Google Flow. So I think this is actually a great technique that you can utilize, especially if you're working with many items or elements that you want to include in the video. So yeah, that's basically it. And again, the prompt is available in the description down below. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you on my next video.